Virgo and Aries. This is like Mars attack, feel me? Where the humans on Earth was like misunderstood. Like, where the fuck all these aliens come from? Mars came here to shut shit down, take over the land. And this is where the misunderstanding between the Aries and the Virgo starts and begins. The Aries can be very impulsive, which means they don't beat around the bush. They get right to it. Virgos, they love to basically put two and two together, <coughs> make sense out of things, and of course, <coughs> be a one that's making sure you're being fulfilled, <coughs> pleasure in bed. Ten times out of ten, a Virgo is going to make a relationship like a job. I mean, so this is the process of Mercury being exalted in Mercury, and of course, the process of Venus falling here. Which means that the love is lost here. Feel me? Like, love gotta make... The love don't... Like, if it don't make dollars, it don't make sense. Feel me? If, if it don't have no actual meaning, no practicality to it, no stability to it, no drive, no affection, and of course, that person is not gonna really be into it, a.k.a. the Virgo. And of course, these two individuals are like high heads. They can, they're gonna get into a whole lot of fist fights, a whole lot of arguments. Feel me? They're gonna get into a whole lot of disagreements. They can both nag each other. Put each other into a position because you know they fire and earth for me fire is gonna like pretty much melt the earth i mean so it's like it's like damn that's how it's gonna be like yo you you, you gonna really gonna fucking burn my shirt you gonna burn me like that you 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 really gonna do me like that man? that's what the virgo can pretty much look too much into emphasis looking at the details making sure things are right aries don't read it aries not gonna read it around aries is gonna basically push forward or aries, or aries all aries know is take charge that's all they know is take charge the, the the Virgo, they can do their own. They have their own perspective on how they basically do the outlining and how they basically cater and put things together. Feel me? But these two individuals, like they both gotta have some deep understandings and know that their modalities is different. Almost to the point where the relationship may not even last long. Only if they understand and understand that if y'all on some spiritual shit, it's gonna last way longer. But if you and your indulgence and you and your desires and you don't have no purpose and no bond on what you're trying to basically build, then it's already not gonna work out. These two individuals, they're gonna always be active in a relationship. For me, almost to the point that the Virgo might fuck around, and just be the maid to the to the Aries. That's how serious it can be pretty much pretty much get. Also, Aries, is, you know, um, feminine sides don't really like to basically being seen in the light. <coughs> Aries, you know, they don't really care too much about, like, they get it, they get it, they cool with it, feel me, they're not gonna really go to the extremes about it, feeling, but they're gonna do what they're gonna basically do, though. If, um, the, Ar the Aries can pretty much help the, um, Virgo be more passionate, more impulsive, and not beat around the bush, the Virgo can pretty much teach the Aries to basically think more practical, put things into practice, and of course, have a balanced mechanism when you communicate and interact with individuals as a whole, 